Good morning, everybody. Let me get my list ready here. Okie dokie. Uh. Mm. Falling behind. You know, I don't know how fucking far behind we are. I don't know. I don't really care either. Dyrus is max level. I don't, I'm not playing with Dyrus. Raids aren't out for a month, apparently. There you go. Who cares? Whatever. Anyways, uh, this is the list this week. Happy's Humble Burger Farm has been getting spammed. Christmas Horror. Uh, Big Larry. Mm. Auction. Fuck, it's trailer time. Let's let's pause that. Burp. Oh god. That's a lot. Okay. Okay, so that's a game that exists. Uh, what is Christmas Horror? I can't hear it. It's just fucking quiet as shit. Mm. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to have to figure it out when I play it. It's $2, so poggers. Right now. Okay. Five dollars, one user review. Wait, what? actual reviews I don't know I feel like they don't because I can't fathom like, like the only reviews I ever see it, it, it looks like paid reviews people with mental illness or people promoting their like YouTube channel I don't see anything outside of those three categories
But I'm sure they exist. I just, I can't fathom doing it. Like leaving a genuine review on a Steam game that like no one plays. People get free keys from devs and they leave reviews. 10 reviews equals it shows up on the Steam page when you browse games. Really? Okay. Well, I guess they're there. That makes sense. But they're kind of paid in a way, right? I mean, like, I get sponsored to play games all the time, and in my contract it says I can shit talk the game all I want. I'm not paid to say nice things, but I still don't say mean things because I feel bad. I bet they feel the same way. Someone dev gives them a key. Okay, this looks awful. I'll probably play this. 20 reviews. Among Us? Is this a scary game or is this just like parkour? Hmm. What are you doing? What? This is the... Are you this bad at video games? Is this really the best you can fucking do? This is making me angry. What the fuck? I can't even understand your mistakes are so fucking bad. Okay, now I get it. Now I see, now I see you're gaming a little bit. Nice. How is this a horror game? Oh. Hmm. Where the fuck I am? Okay, so this game cost $4. It's positive. A heroic story about the unforgettable journey of the cat, Darchi, trying to find his life in the underworld with different physical properties. Okay. Um, I don't know why you put horror next to this, Volps. I am truly baffled, but let's keep going. Mm. Was it me? Pink tank? I don't know what the fuck's going on in your brain. Now he? It's no. clever marketing trick. Now you think that no one can be this bad and certainly not you. You can do a lot better, so you buy the game to show us that you are not that bad. Also to show off gravity feature. You're right. Holy fuck. That was an interesting drop. Big Brain Academy. Brain versus Brain. $29. You have a trailer? Ah, oh, fuck.
This one would be fun on stream streamer. start downloading it for now that's step one god fucking shit it sucks that's great i can't wait to play the game that sucks great fucking awesome how do i tell this thing how do i turn a switch on mm. initiate there's a math game i actually am great at math by the way um, just say. Uh, shit. Hang on. I gotta go to the store and... I still have Wheel of Fortune open. Oh, my God. Why is my left controller not working? Uh, close the software. Yeah, close it. How do I turn on a controller? It was plugged in the whole time. I don't understand. Wait, I'm just gonna hold down this little button here. Do I need to do something here? How do I sync it? Is there a sync button on the switch? What if I just plug it into the switch and call it a day? Okay, I slot. Oh, I okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. Mm. Shit! Now only one controller is working. Okay, now they're both on. All right. Got it. Uh, so let me go to the Nintendo eShop, and let me go full cam. Oh, God. My audio is fucked on it, but I don't feel like fixing it. Recent releases. Big Brain. All right, I bought it. Uh, I saw some really weeb game on here that looked interesting-ish. Yo, Katana Zero on Switch? What the frick? I feel like I should play games on the Switch more and just like beat up children. Aha. Oh, dang and Ropa, ugh. All right, let me go back to the main page here and start downloading it, because that's why I'm doing it now. It takes, like, fucking five years. Close, close. All right. Ooh, it's downloading already. Hey, it's almost already done. Holy shit, this game is tiny. All right, more trailers. Hmm. Oh, you survive waves of zombies as a chicken. That's garbage.
Oh god. Okay, so that's uh, twelve dollars. <laughs> All right. the dev whoop de doo <laughs> Oh my god, my fucking yes. switch. I'm done running. I thought this game just like had some weird shit happening. What is going on in this game? Um, it's a it's like space combat. Okay, meh. Oh shit. Is it like the crowd supposed to be yelling at you? What the fuck is going on? Oh my god. Seven dollars, mostly positive. All right, that looks sick. Is 
This is a, oh, it's a life sim type shit. I suck at these. So you build a mall? Oh god. Okay. I'm I'm I I I really suck at those games. Mega Jammer. Like, everyone just ends up depressed. But this looks cool. Your examination results as follows. Symptoms of PTSD. Common for an ex-Earth collective soldier. Mild CSV infection. Katatana's handshake. Cranial Aug needs a service. She's still our best hacker, though. Three firearm injuries. We can thank our Quinton friends for that. Broken toe, whiplash, wolf bite, and increase in impulsive and risky behavior. Fit and ready as far as I'm concerned. The sooner she gets back out there, the sooner we get that shiny new ship. This just looks weird, but also interesting. I don't know. Let's hope there's something left of us to escape with. Is that William Defoe? That sounds like William Defoe with like a crazy filter on him. Either way, uh, Arc Vale. Please be a boss fight game where you fight bosses, please. Okay, this looks cool. Oh, yeah. This looks cool. Okay, I like this game. I want to play that one. Examination Chambers. You have no time limit for figuring this out and no instructions will ever be given. Great. Oh, God. Okay, so box uh, boxes. Okay, a lot of people were sponsored to play this game, but it unironically looked pretty cool. 
I know how people feel about sponsored games. They didn't pay me to play it. Boring after a while. I can see that. I just thought it looked cool. Like the fire breathing. I think I was watching Admiral Baru play it. Lyric played it. Dang it. Did, were they all paid? I didn't get paid. I'm pissed. God damn it. All right. This game is called Buy It Now. All right, so it's basically that, um, what's that one game called? Alt F4. I mean, it's just like, ever since getting over it, man. Okay, what's going on here? Nope. No plan B. I'm pregnant. What the fuck? I don't know if I'd like this. Moving on. Oh, God. I'm so picky, man. As soon as it's like a fucking RTS type shit, please don't be like top down building a city. I can't do them. I don't think it, no. Not for me. Oh, 
cocaine? Oh. <laughs> no! This looks excellent. I could totally play this. <laughs> Welcome to Casino Tycoon Simulator. Here, you can realize your dreams as a manager of your own casino. You can create, upgrade, and operate your businesses. Sell cars with giveaways to your customers. Upgrade your security and protect the vault from thieves and cheaters. Join the crypto market. Make, buy and sell or mine Bitcoin while your vault is filling with money. This is Casino Tycoon Simulator. There's no way to They're lose They're all bad. Here. Uh, okay. What is Bloons TD Battles 2? Mixed reviews. Do people not like this game? I thought they loved it. Oh, the XP grind? Huh. Yeah, I thought people loved this shit. Interesting. Okay, this looks awful. $12? Okay. Only a couple more games here to look at. This looks pretty fun. It's like Pummel Party. Waifus? Gotcha machine. All right, checking reviews. Mostly positive. Top comment. Decent game, despite being in early access. In game, there's a chance to unlock some suggestive cosplay pictures slash videos and avatars. No nudity so far, but there's quite a bit of eye candy. You can download them onto your computer as well. Support this game to help create funds for Mir too. <laughs> Damn. That's crazy. I can download it on my computer? <laughs> Hopefully nudity comes out with Mir too. The DLC pack. 
The perfect plan? Check. The perfect gear? Check. Uh, yes. The perfect disguise? Check. Oh, come on. Steal as much as you can. And... Escape with the loot. Play solo or gang up with other bandits in co-op. Escape bandits, switch sides, and play as the cops. Ready to bust your friends. 25 levels to infiltrate in heist, arcade, and brawl modes. Wait, this could be in Hold on. To unlock new bandit content. Assemble nice. all your partners in crime with crossplay. I kind of wanted to see the gameplay more. That could be interesting. Show me gameplay now. Here's the plan for in the night. Here we go. So wait, where's the money? Are you supposed to like get the money and then leave? Oh, there they are. But where'd they get the money? I don't see it. Oh. That actually looks kind of fun. All right. Uh, four more. Fights in tight places. Oh, this game. Ugh. Huh. Uh, he? Not really trying to tell you what to do, but you could always just play FF at like 12 a.m. if you wanted to fuck your sleep schedule. Yeah, if you queue before 12 p.m. EST, okay. usually no issues either. <sighs> Thanks. True. Mm. I mean, the game looks cool. It do. I do want to try it, but... I have a lot of card games in my life right now. Welcome to Zalesha. A village somewhere between dense forests and marshes. There are too many sophisticated attractions here. Unless speaking of minefields. Vodka. Polite neighbors. Moonshine. Strange neighbors. Beer. Wild animal breeding. Local cuisine. Can okay. Hmm. Wait, this game? I beat this game. DLC? Or maybe it's just out on Steam. Oh. Was it not on Steam already? Or was it on Epic Games? Okay, so it's just the Steam release. I already beat this game. Moving on. Welcome to the ISS Alithia, the largest and safest spaceship ever built, where the Captain AI has unfortunately gone rogue. Follow your way to victory to shut down the AI, whose only goal is to kill all on board. Partner with fellow residents to survive. Be sure to dress to impress. Hello. Hello. 
Good job, Gary. <laughs> Work with fellow residents and enjoy a glass of champagne on the way. Drink some water. Be wary of friendly faces. Oh, it's happening. Oh. Okay, okay. Uh... Common dangers may include slippery surfaces. Oh, oh, it's already, oh my god. I'm so sorry. Uh, uh... Oh no, help! Help! Questionable installations. Oh my All god. Right. Loose wiring. Catching fire. They never told me fire would be hot. The occasional homicide. <laughs> not okay. It's not okay. Not like this. Deduce, deceive, but most importantly, have fun and enjoy the chaos. <laughs> okay, so it's Among Us, but this actually looks interesting. I kind of want to play this with a group of people and see how it goes. This does look interesting. All right, let me see if there's anything in the big release trailer. Nope, nothing there. All right. Anyways, I'll message it to Rob and see if he's interested. Uh, and I'll message Vigor, too. Uh, message Moon. Message sure for. Message Nick. All right, I'll see the responses.